I think I can say um, the, it is serious, and the specific data my colleague can uh, introduce you, but the uh, situation is serious, and um, so if we don't act urgently, then it will have uh, not only impact on the climate change, but uh, importantly, to the people, and also, as you heard uh, this morning, we will look at water resource availability and also uh, the agriculture, so uh, the, the food production itself. And so that's why it is important for this region to deal with um, short-lived climate change pollutants and also other well, first of all, it has co-benefits, and uh, it is uh, compared to the greenhouse gases, especially carbon dioxide, it is much easy to reduce, and we already have uh, technologies and know-hows and, and so on. And so that's one reason. And then the other one is uh, it has a great impact on people. And uh, as I said, water and the food. And so that is, that is why. And because this carbon dioxide, the CO2, we are having, uh, still having, everybody agrees that we have to do something. And, but um, many reasons, uh, the countries are not uh, acting uh, fast enough. And, but with this uh, short-lived uh, climate uh, pollutants, many countries already, as I said, have technologies and know-hows, and, and its impact is uh, uh, very significant if we try to uh, reduce the temperature, global temperature, under 2 degrees Celsius uh, by 2050.